Hi, Cubbies. I wonder where our good friend Cubby Bear is. I haven't seen him yet today. Let's call for him together and see if he'll come talk to us. Ready? One, two, three. Cubby! Ruff, ruff. Katie, have you seen Cubby Bear? We were hoping he'd come talk to us. Yes, I have. Cubby, Timothy, and I were playing a game of catch with Timothy's friends, Mia and Will. That sounds fun. It is. I love to play catch. I can catch the ball in my mouth when I jump high up in the air. Katie, that is amazing. Thanks. And I have a new trick too. I can hold the ball on my nose. Well, that's incredible, but I'm still wondering where Cubby Bear is. Well, after we played catch, we decided to play hide and seek. I am really good at that game too. Mia began to count and the rest of us ran to hide. Timothy and Cubby ran to the woodshed to hide. Well, that seems like a good place. It is, except that Timothy's dad saw that the woodshed door was open. He stopped mowing the grass and went over to the woodshed to close the door. Then he locked it. But Timothy and Cubby were inside. Yep. What did you do? Well, I started barking and chasing Timothy's dad while he was riding on the big lawnmower. I tried to get his attention, but he didn't hear me. And then he got too far away. Oh, listen, I think I hear the lawnmower coming back this way. I need to get Timothy's dad so he can help Timothy and Cubby Bear get out of the woodshed. Bye, boys and girls. I'll see you later. Bye, Katie. Run really fast. Okay, Cubbies. Well, I hope Katie catches Timothy's dad soon so he can help save Timothy and Cubby Bear from the woodshed. Today in our lesson, we are going to learn about someone else who was trapped and how Jesus saved them. Bye, Cubbies. I'll see you next week.